going to be shooting 6.5 Creedmoor, 142 grain Acubon long range through a piece of genuine leather snakeskin print into my gel that I've cast a piece of uh, scheduled 40 PVC pipe in to simulate bone hopefully we can catch this bullet chunk into my block here out the top carrying some of that synthetic bone fragments with it and uniquely enough a bullet landed right on my table beautiful little mushroom Before it penetrated, I don't have my tape measure on me, but the size of those blocks, you're at over 25 inches before it exited the gel. They're obviously going to to stretch the gel up, flung that energy back. I'm going to get over 20 inches of penetration, massive wound channel. That massive wound channel carries. All the way, quite all the way through that first block that you're carrying synthetic bone in with it past the 15 inch mark. I um, have to say at the higher velocities, more than lethal, phenomenal round. I'm going to have to cast some more blocks and test it shooting through my synthetic bone at uh, you know, reduce loads at a lower velocity just to see how well they'll perform shooting through bone but I'm going to say that did a phenomenal job overall let's see what the velocity was on that one 2704 when it hit the gel you can see on that gel a little bit of leather caused that bolt to start opening almost instantly and when it hit that schedule 40 pvc simulating bone the bullet definitely held its integrity didn't uh didn't over fragment and carried bits and pieces of bone up in with well over 20 inches of penetration i'm um, at that velocity i'd say that's a phenomenal bullet with the perfect mushroom.